To succeed financially, he has six money skills you need to master to be 10 years ahead of others financially. 1. Network with people. Your ability to succeed and find opportunities depends on the people you know. So, you need to connect yourself with people and not just people, ambitious people, people with goals, aims and ambition, people in high position and authority, people who are on the quest for greatness. If you can network yourself with this type of people, then they'll start to influence you. They'll start to change your perspective and orientation about things. They'll start to show you what to do, how to do it, the necessary steps to take, how to become a better person in all aspects of your life and of course, including financial aspects. 2. Avoid creep lifestyle. To live a creep lifestyle means to live a life without goals, a life without ambition, a life that settles for just anything, a life that is guided by trends and not goals. So, if you want to be financially free, you need to start focusing on important things, things that really matter, things that help you become a better person. You need to set your goals and priorities right. Don't settle for less. Have a target and go for it. 3. Become marketable. The truth is the pay you receive is directly proportional to the talent you have and how you market this talent. So, you need to market yourself and you can't market yourself if you don't have a skill. So, you need a skill to market yourself and if you already have a skill, then you might as well acquire a new skill to increase your earning potential because the more skill you have, the more problems you are able to provide solutions to and the more money you earn while providing solutions to those problems. So, more skill means more money and more assets to invest. Learn a new skill and market your skill. 4. Focus more on your needs rather than your wants. You need to set your priorities straight by focusing more on your needs rather than your wants. A need is a necessity to live and function. So, save and invest money before storing on wants. You might actually need to stand out modestly in everything you do in order to achieve this. And you need to prioritize your spending so that it won't be unnecessary to spend on things that doesn't matter. 5. Buy assets. You can't save your way up to wealth. Saving is a good idea since it provides a safety net and gives you access to cash if needed. But with time, money loses its value with inflation. So, the best way to really save is buying appreciating assets that makes more money for you. And lastly, 6. Be financially literate. The truth is, many people are poor not because they lack money, but rather because they lack financial literacy. Financial literacy is the ability to understand and effectively use various financial skills including personal financial management, budgeting, and investments. It is the foundation to your relationship with money. So you need to be financially literate to earn and manage your funds. And the key to being financially literate include learning how to create a budget, track spending, pay off debts, and plan for retirement. This is Edutip in Nigeria. And our job basically is to project education through media. So we hope you've learned in one way or the other. Thank you.